Hey everyone, welcome back. I know it's been a while. Uh, it's been like a good long while since I posted uh, my last video, but I'm back and I've actually got a pretty good video in store. It's, um, as you can see by the title, I'm going to be reacting to a, uh, a Shin Lim performance on America's Got Talent since it, uh, America's Got Talent came back, I believe it was Tuesday they came back with their auditions and everything. So I saw, you know, I saw that Shin Lim was on there. So I decided, you know, what better way to come back to the channel than to react to you know, Shin Lim, one of the a really great sleight of hand, close up magic type of guys. So I hope you're going to enjoy this video and let's get straight on to the reaction. All right. So I've actually never seen a, a Shin Lim performance before. I know who he is, but I haven't actually seen him perform that many times. But let's see how this goes. Just pick one. Anyone. All right, pretty, pretty reasonable. Just picking a card. Oh, you can see yeah. it. Oh, okay. Can you write your name? I'm signing okay. it, yeah. All right. Pretty standard so far. I love the music. It's really very mysterious. Pretty good. Oh That's really good. Wow. Cat calling. It's funny. That's pretty good. It's a really nice presentation. I like the tattoo of Venus Fade. That's really cool. I really like the misdirection that he put with it. It really enhanced the effect. It's like some of the things during performance I'll see, but like how you follow the performance, you can get misdirected too. And it's like, even as a magician, you can still get fooled and caught off guard. That's, that's actually pretty great. Like he took something so simple and still made it look amazing. That's the thing, you know? That's why you always gotta stick with these bases because he made it look great. Okay. I just love how the music builds. It just really fits the performance. Oh, uh, it's that move. Um, I've always wanted to know how to do that. I just, I just found it so cool that little paintbrush technique with the cards. I've always wanted to know how to do that. Pointing to the envelope. That's really nice. Very, very nice effect. I like that a lot. Okay. What's gonna happen next? There. Got me there. Oh my god. Well, that's a really nice reveal. It just slowly revealed itself. So we're just appearing at a thinner. That's really nice. Classic smoke effect. That's really cool. Especially when it's happening in their own hands. It's like really great. That is my name. Oh my god. If I hmm. get this inside of like glass or something, it's like sealed inside. No? Oh, that that ending was definitely something else. I 
like just the way he took that glass box, put it in the card box, and then tore it up. That was that was actually a really strong ending because the entire performance like like was building. You know, it had this part and that built into something else better, and it just kept on going. And that's something that's actually like like really really good. So um, overall, that was a great performance. I I'll definitely probably look into more Shinlin performances because that was something that was something else. You know, it definitely like definitely like instills like that whole sense of like magic it's like whoa you know it has to be magic and that's that's really great you know um overall i like that performance a lot and um yeah fooled me multiple times it part of it was really because it you know caught me off guard i think but I, i'll probably go over that and rewatch it multiple times just to see if i can catch more things because i did catch a few things um but definitely gonna go over it because i really like that performance a lot so I hope you guys like this video, and if you want to see more videos like this, then definitely uh, hit the like button, comment down below, subscribe, do all that things, because it helps me out. So, I'll see you guys next time.